Hey, I'm Kit. And I'm John. We've driven across this country a bunch of times. But this is our first time doing it in a motorhome. Come along with us on our RV road trip up the Southern California coast, where the next adventure is just around the corner. Oh my God, it fit. <laughs> <laughs> it's a big gay world. So let's hit the road and go see it together. Next stop, Solvang with our friends Yaz and Stacy. Lovely. Our RV adventures continue. Nice. Oh, yeah. <laughs> this is so beautiful. This is so pretty. I've never walked through grapevines before, oh, and that's kind neither. of shocking me. You never forget your first grapevine. Right. I just want to take this menu item, enhance the experience, and just apply it to everything. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to Andrew Murray Vineyards. We are gonna get started with our extra pour today. It's gonna to be the Esperance Rosé. Is it a great to get out of Los Angeles? Yes. Yeah, and we just don't do it often enough. We don't think to do it. I feel like I'm in like a California movie. Sideways, literally. Right? Yeah, 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 exactly, <laughs> yes. exactly. Yes. Cheers, Cheers, queers. <laughs> Hello. Welcome to Lucas and Llewellyn. This vineyard is where we grow our Bordeaux varietals. We grow Sauvignon Blanc at this vineyard as well as our Los Alamos vineyard. Pour you some. Thank you. Does wine bring a lot of visitors to the area? It does indeed, yes. So that's one of the big draws to the San Inez Valley. We have over 150 different wineries in the area. Solvang was a town settled by Danes uh, about a mile down the road here. And the town is still uh, a good percentage of the population is Danish. By the 60s, they sort of realized what they had and a lot more Danish architecture came in. Two wineries down, 148 to go. How cute is Solvang, you guys? I know, it's actually adorable. It looks like there's something to find behind every little corner. Really Still cute. predominantly Danish, though. Like, how cool is that? <laughs> it's a Danish Disneyland with alcohol. <laughs> Pretty much. <laughs> All right, well, should we okay. explore the town? Yeah, let's do it. Let's let's do do it. it. I was gonna make a joke and say, is it Christmas all year round? But it is. It is. <laughs> Jewel House Christmas all year round. Get some plants to sure, decorate yeah. the RV. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Welcome to Wonder Child. This store is curated and designed and owned by Matt and Kyle Cavalli. They are absolutely amazing. It's a pop and pop shop. They have four amazing kiddos. So as you walk around the shop, you'll see a lot of diversity, inclusivity. Um, them growing up mostly in a small town like this, they didn't have anything where they felt like they belonged or they were welcome for being different. So they wanted to make this a solution in whatever way they could. We just pulled into town and we're drawn to the rainbow flag and what a pleasant surprise it is to find a yes. store like this in a little town yes. like Solvang. Yes. yes. I love just being able to end a day here and have your own little space. When you're in a car or an RV or whatever it is, you can choose your own path and that for people like us, that's a real blessing because I don't want to go and do what other people are doing. I want to do what I want to do, yeah. you know? To doing what you want to do. Absolutely. Yes. So. <laughs> 